What's going on everybody? Zunk the Kayak Guy here. Now I want to talk about Elizabeth fucking Warren. Alright, everybody knows I'm a staunch defender of the Second Amendment. Everybody knows this. My channel, you know, I talk about concealed carry being completely destroyed in South Carolina and assault weapons bans and all kinds of other shit. Well, douchebag Warren has taken this way, way too far. Of course, naturally, she wants an assault weapons ban that's, you know, normal for any Democrat. She wants to, I mean, it's not the only thing she wants to ban. I'm just going to tell you that now. It is not the only thing she wants to ban. Um, you want to hear a laundry list of bullshit she wants to, uh, to, to ban? Um, let's see. High capacity magazines. Well, to everybody else, it's standard capacity magazines. But to her, you know, because she's a left-leaning moron who absolutely knows nothing about firearms whatsoever. It's a high capacity mag. Uh, she wants to um, have an assault weapons ban and a mandatory um, turn in of, well, not a mandatory turn in. She wants the assault weapons ban, uh, any kind of, um, any kind of uh, importation of the AR 15 or AK 47 or any, anything like that. She wants to completely uh, get rid of your ability to uh, buy these guns or components. So she wants to do pretty much the same thing that they're doing in California, which is, um, which Gavin Newsom, what a twat just signed into law that um, you cannot buy any uh, uh, parts for your guns to so say you know your firing pin, firing pin brakes or recoil spring brakes you're shit out of luck you can't just order it and have it sent to your house anymore you're gonna have to have it shipped to an FFL if you live in California. Now, Senator Warren, who's running for president and is a complete and total nutcase, wants to do the exact same shit. She wants to force you, Mr. and Mrs. America, to go and turn in all you guys. Number one. She wants you to make sure you are registering your AR-15, your AK-47. She's not asking for mandatory bag, buyback. But she's asking for registration. And registration leads to confiscation. We all know this. We all know it. Okay. <clears throat> but she wants you to either register it or destroy it by a legal FFL or she wants you to hand it into the government um, how about uh, no uh, fuck you how about that um <clears throat> So, we've got, you know, a few other things that Senator Warren wants to accomplish. She wants to eliminate how many guns you can buy per month. To do that, 
she wants to propose a law that will not allow you to buy more than one gun per month. So if you want to buy, say, a shotgun and a handgun because you want to go hunting, say you want to hunt bear, you want to hunt moose, you want to carry, take a, you know, mid-sized hand cannon with you, sorry, you're fucked. Sorry about your luck, you're done. You're not going to be able to do it because under her law, that will be illegal. The AR-15 would be illegal. So, <clears throat> yeah, there's that. There's also a complete ban on 80% lowers, which, if you don't know what an 80% lower is right now, and you're in the gun community, okay, so fine. Okay, I'll tell you. Um, an 80% lower is basically a block of aluminum. It's a paperweight. It serves no purpose until... Um, until, you know... Whoops. Oh well. Didn't mean to do that. It serves no purpose until you get either take it to an FFL or a federal firearms license e person and have it machined. Uh, you can buy your own desktop uh, uh, small CNC machine and do it that way. That's perfectly legal. It's called making a firearm, just as long as you don't sell it. And that's a that's a key thing here. You you can't sell the the firearm in question because you know unserialized firearm would be illegal. Oh bollocks. So, <clears throat> she wants to prevent you from even being able to CNC that 80% lower. She wants to ban everything to do with making your own firearms at home. Uh, that includes, as it also includes muskets, flint locks, um, um, cap and ball guns. Anything that involves a round to be fired out of a gun will be illegal as per uh, Senator Warren. And the fun does not stop there. <laughs> now you will need to buy, well, get two kinds of licenses should she become president to buy ammunition but she splits it it's not only pistol ammunition you have to get a separate license to buy pistol ammunition and then they've lumped shotgun and rifle ammunition into the same category so that will probably cost about as much as a, uh, a uh, tax stamp does for an SBR about two hundred fifty dollars. Um, on top of that, she wants to raise the tax. Currently, the tax for ammo is around, I think, it's six percent. She wants to raise the uh, tax on ammunition up to ninety-five percent. As from what I understand, it's either 65 or 95 percent. My eyesight's getting a little bad, so it was kind of blurry. Oh, you can skip this. Cool. But she wants to raise the ammo tax to match the. Um, there's one other tax that you can get in um, that 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 is taxed right now. That's insanity. 
I think it's the gas tax. The federal gas tax. I think that's it. But yeah, she wants to match that. Or beat it. For your ammo. So, your average run-of-the-mill ammunition for, say, your uh, 223, which would be... Uh, <clears throat> it would be, um, what, Lake City Armory, Winchester's now running it, so, or say Winchester White Box, say it costs about $8 for 20 rounds. Under Senator Warren, with a 60 to a 90% hike in tax, you could be paying in upwards of $30, 25 to $30 for that same box of ammunition when she gets elected president. She's not going to get elected president. Period. I don't fucking think so. Besides, who's going to want to vote for a skinny little bitch who faked getting a beer with her husband? I mean, come on. Really? You're going to want to vote for something like that? No. Don't vote. Don't vote for something like that. If if if, if you want to vote for Senator Warren, oh yeah, Senator Warren's the best, yeah, yeah. Stay home. She's a bitch. She's a fake bitch. She's telling you all this crap. She's full of it. She's telling you all this mess just to get you to vote for her. That's it. I mean, a lot of po politicians do the exact same shit, but she is running the fucking farm on the con this kind of shit. Okay, so the horror does not end there. She wants to get the ATF... Well, she wants to empower the ATF to make more laws. Now, I don't know about you, the ATF does not make laws. They enforce the laws. Just recently, they also told President Trump that they cannot make laws when it comes to the Second Amendment, when it comes to those bump stocks. They cannot make the law. So, i.e., if you have a bump, bump stock right now, they may say you're not allowed to have it, but... They can't come and take it from you. It's a violation. They can't do it. And you say, oh, well, you know, it's illegal. Somebody's already been uh, arrested for it. Da, 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 da. I said, yeah. And I guarantee they'll win in court because the ATF cannot enforce that law. There is no law banning the use of and possession of bump stocks because the ATF is not allowed to make laws like that they're just not it's against it's against the law lawmakers in Congress have to do those things so <clears throat> anyway I digress she wants, you know, to, to empower the ATF to create more laws to, no, two for one. And I'm a terrible shot. But, you know, who's the best shot in the world, you know? Who cares? Um, she wants to empower the ATF to create more laws she doesn't say what these laws are. But she wants the ATF to do it. Because she thinks that the ATF is a part of Congress. Great. Another moron senator. That's all we fucking need. We have Ocasio-Cortez, who's a moron representative, who doesn't know what the three branches of government is, doesn't know what a fucking garbage disposal is. <clears throat> now we have Senator fucking Warren who thinks, for some strange fucking reason, 
that the ATF can somehow make laws. Yay! Fucking retards. And I say that. Uh, actually, no, I, I shouldn't say that they're retards because that would be insulting mentally deficient people. These people are mentally deficient on a whole different level. I mean, seriously. Fucking moronic. And you got stupid. You got dumb. And then you got moronic. And guess what? Senator Warren fits that bill perfectly. So, I just wanted to warn you, give you a heads up. If you're in the Second, Second Amendment community, it doesn't matter whether you're on the left, like moderate de Democrat, or you're on the right, uh, Republican, this should concern the hell out of you. It really should. You should scream from the heavens that, you know, Senator Warren is a complete and total lunatic and she has lost her fucking mind. So, you know, do, do you can, do what you can, call your senators, call your house of representatives, say, Elizabeth Warren has lost her fucking mind, kind of like Hillary Clinton did, or has, <clears throat> and currently is still doing. I don't want her to be president, she is a fucking crap loser. She's about as dumb as Ocasio-Cortez, and that's giving Ocasio-Cortez some massive credence that somebody is on her level. <clears throat> she is going to be bad for our country. She's going to be bad for our Second Amendment. And guess what the Second Amendment says? Shall not be infringed. But I'm going to add an extra part to, part to that. Shall not be fucking infringed. Hell no. We will not comply. Fuck off. That is my, my message to Senator Warren. Fuck you. We Second Amendment uh, uh, enthusiasts, we will not comply with your tyrannical bullshit. Fuck you, you skinny bitch. Get the fuck out of Congress. You don't belong there. You're of retirement age. You're starting to sag. Even your mind is starting to fucking sink down through your neck and you're now starting to come out your ass. Go the fuck away. So all my subscribers, I gained a new subscriber. I forgot to mention this in the last video. I gained a new subscriber. Thank you for your subscription. Love you. Thank you. More subscribers are needed for me to get my message out there. I've got another video coming up. This one's a serious one. And you've got to share it. You've got to spread it around. This word has got to get around to all conservatives and all gun channels. Anybody who has the Constitution and, and the flag held to their heart, you've got to get my next video around. you got to share it. All right? Talk to you all soon. Love you. Do long division. Later. Oh, fuck. Even I don't know how to work a goddamn PS4. Shit.